If you follow me on social media, you know I've been pointing out that Silicon Valley's real estate market performs differently than the rest of the nation and even differently than some other counties within the Bay Area. And that's because we are Silicon Valley and the vast majority of tech workers choose to live here due to proximity to headquarters of most major tech companies and VCs. With the return to work mandates in many of these companies, housing choices are going to be returning to normal patterns. You live close to where you work. For most young tech workers who are looking to advance their careers and network groups, there's no other place like Silicon Valley. And unlike most possessions which lose value over time, real estate values increase over time making them ideal long-term investments. What other factor guarantees this increase in values will continue? The perpetual shortage and inability to build housing to meet the demands in Silicon Valley. It has been and will be for a long time. Even with people leaving the area here, we always have more people coming in to replace them. So houses get sold and bought with each transfer. A perfect example, Tesla and Oracle may have left the area and took employees with them, but the new AI industry, which is seen as the biggest thing since the internet itself perhaps, and their startups and stealth modes and, uh, get, and getting their employees, seed money and facilities to house them, all where? Right here in Silicon Valley, of course. And what do all these people do when they get money? Buy homes, of course. So for these smart, young, up-and-comers, this is a real simple calculation. Why pay a landlord and gain nothing when you can buy an expensive home, but watch it gain even more in value while you live in it? Guaranteeing that you will make more money than you originally invested by huge sums in the long run. If you see it from this insider's perspective, things are not so crazy as it would look like from an outsider's perspective. And that is why we keep seeing prices go higher and higher as housing inventory cannot keep up with the demands. One thing that these highly analytical tech people can figure out very quickly is the future value of properties based on what they see in the past. It's a no-brainer, really. They have determined paying more for higher mortgage rates today is a better investment than hoping and waiting for prices to drop when they never do. Hoping is not an investment strategy as many have found out over the years. And that is why Silicon Valley real estate market is often different than many other places. As long as the tech industry and the VC money is based here, it will continue to be this way for the foreseeable future.